Hey, peace and blessings. This is Javonna, the Spiritual Love Coach. I am doing something a little different today. I'm doing a reading from my Whispers of Love deck. And if you see those wonderful little scribbles, that Savvy's handiwork, she decided to decorate my box. Um, so the cards that I pulled today, and they were so timely, was to practice compassion and to have patience. And these go hand in hand. Being compassionate will give you patience. Being patient will help you to be compassionate. So let's talk about these two energies and why this came up. We're getting ready to go into the holiday season. Things are probably going to start getting busy and bustling. And we need to be more compassionate and patient with ourselves and with others, with our little ones, with our friends, with our families, with our coworkers. See things from a different perspective helps you to have compassion for others. Realize that we are all human and we are all different. There are no two people who are the same. And the idea that we are all supposed to be the same, that we're all supposed to believe the same things, creates so much separation. And that's where a lot of hatred can be born at because people don't understand the fact that we're all different I don't know it's weird but look for ways where you can be a little more compassionate and can have patience with people for me myself personally <laughs> I really do um, have the ability to be compassionate I am an empath, so I can pick up on how people feel. I know I can kind of sense like what's going on. And a lot of times I feel for people because we just go through so much. And sometimes I can see someone and I'm like, dang, they're really going through it. I wish I should say something, but I don't want to be like, oh, you know, I just kind of had this picked up on your energy and here's a hug. So I don't really do that to people. But if you only knew the weight that people carry around with them, you would have so much more patience and compassion for them. Um, in our daily, and I don't know why, but I keep picking up on work. Like this is around work. Maybe you got work issues going on too. So let's talk about our workplace and those relationships that we have there, right? Because I'm the spiritual love coach and I am all about relationships, healing and love. And our relationships are not limited to just intimate relationships or dating. We have relationships with our family, our coworkers, our friends. Relationships are everywhere. And I hope that the more you follow me, the more you'll get to see how in depth and how varied our relationships are with the world around us.